weight, right there where my cursor is. Um, I put it 6.9 below to 7.2. And now I'm going to click over here and I'll show you what's close to it. This is something we don't talk about very much. This is a big geothermal field. See that little dot right there? That's a volcano. Watch this people. It's really cool. I'm studying this volcano right now. This is Sierra Prieto volcano. This is the crater. This is the cinder cone around it. Over here is the lagoon. Now watch when I go right into the crater. It's a very interesting crater. There's graffiti in the crater. Here's what the crater looks like inside. There's some um, local Mexican kids did their names. There's lots of magma six to ten miles under all this. It's interesting zone, a part of the mid-oceanic ridge, the Pacific part of it. And I'm taking you out, and I'm going to go over here and I'm going to click on this, Salton Buttes. And if you, you know, here, here it is. This is a nearby volcano in the Salton Sea on the American side of the border. It's called Salton Buttes. It's an active volcano. I'm going to take you in on it. Yet part of the rifting zone. Right here is Bombay Beach where my cursor is, where my finger is. That's the end of the San Andreas Fault. And this is Salton Buttes. It has mud pots and um, this little volcano. It's actually pretty big. It's in 2,000 feet or so of sedimentary rock. This is the volcano. Some more interesting stuff. Here's a picture of Salton Butte Volcano. Salton Sea mud pots near that Salton Sea volcano. So there you have it. Okay, I hope you can see this pretty good. This is this this is mainland Mexico. This is the U.S. and this is um, the continental plate. And over here is the Pacific plate, North American plate, Pacific plate. These two plates are being um, pulled apart, as you can see. Baja California used to be attached to Mexico, and it's it's going away because this is a rifting zone. This this rifting zone goes all the way down, or you know around the ocean, thousands of miles. And it comes up and it ends right about here. And and then there's a transform fault dash, sort of an extension, which is the San Andreas Fault. And this is the area we're studying. Here's San Diego, there's LA, this is Baja California. So this is a rifting zone. And uh, these faults here, that's a transform fault. Now I'm going to give you a close-up of the area we've been studying. Okay, there's there's a 7.2 quake we had. And there's the volcano in Mexico called Sierra Prieto I pointed out. And the round thing, that's the magma underneath, creates a thermal field, a geothermal field. There's a transform fault connecting it to Imperial Fault. Another transform connects it then to the extension of the San Andreas. And there's the salt and buttes. And this is the Salton Sea. This is Salton Sea, and there's some magma under that. We have an earthquake swarm right here, and um, lots and lots of earthquakes right off the Laguna Salada Fault, where it meets the newly ruptured Ua Fault. The Ua Fault ruptured during a 7.2 earthquake on April 4, 2010, not too long ago. And yesterday we had some quakes up here in Borrego Springs, which is on this. Um, I think it's the San Jacinto Fault, if I remember right. See that shape we have here? It reflects a larger picture on a grander scale. It's a rifting zone. And I, my theory is this rifting zone wants to extend up on north. And this is the area I'm most interested in. I really don't give a hoot about the geothermal field down here by Sierra Prieto. I'm not into the controversies there about that. I'm looking at the new stuff. I think this is new. Pretty fascinating stuff.
Okay, that earthquake 25 minutes ago. Um, I wouldn't feel because it's way about a thousand miles or so away, but it's on this rifting zone. See that rifting zone there? That's a transform fault. Quakes and volcanoes like to happen at these intersections here between the rift, the line of the rift, and the transformed. So this rift goes right on up to about here and um, on beyond into salt and sea area where we had a 7.2 and right now a swarm of earthquakes. Remember how I showed you the, this, is, this isn't the Yaha fault, but I showed you that. Um, another fault that kind of looked like this formation, that's where a lot of events happen. Here we have um, a diagram from a scientific paper by Herbert Fabriel. Anyway, this is a rifting zone. There's the Sierra Prieto Fault, and there's the um, the Laguna Salada Fault and the Mexicali Imperial Fault. That's the Imperial Fault, sorry. And we have an earthquake swarm right here. The Yua Fault just forming right there. Um, but I can say that I suspect we'll have a visitor in the form of a volcano down in the rifting area to the south of it, um, like I pointed out, and um, we'll see what happens. Ooh. Ah.